Some people weren't born or perhaps are too young to remember what this nation went through on 9-11, which is why this somber anniversary is so very important. For those of us who were around, it is one of those days that we will always remember exactly what we were doing the morning that first plane hit the World Trade Center. Tonight, our Michael Schwartz giving a voice to Western New Yorkers who will never forget as they reflect on a day that changed our country forever. It hurt. It hurt. You see those lives lost? I thought it was a movie. It was beyond belief. Vivian McManus remembers watching the terror on September 11th, 2001 from her home in the United Kingdom. I was at home and I was a mum of two very young boys at that time and I can distinctly remember I had to go and pick them up from school. It was about three o'clock our time and I can remember I heard it on the television. I think that was when I first heard for the UK time. McManus, who is visiting Buffalo, tells me the heartache was felt from across the pond. I don't think it matters what nationality or where you originate from. As a human being, you've always got empathy for others. And I think the whole nation just set hearts went out for, to you guys. More than 60 people from the UK were killed in the attacks. America on the attack. Byron Morris says it's hard to recall what happened 23 years ago. People I knew went to New York City to visit, and some people was in the building, got caught, and their bodies never been found to this day. Absolutely remember all the days after that too and how this country came together in ways that well we rarely see these days for sure. And before Jim Spillman became principal at St. Joe's in Buffalo, he was a student living in Boston. I was in Boston in graduate school and I remember coming out of a, a class at that time, you know, it didn't have a cell phone, so didn't didn't realize what was happening until you got outside and there were thousands of people gathered outside and, and you started to hear the stories of what happened. The stories are endless from voices that will forever share to remember the faces we'll never forget. Michael Schwartz, 7 News.